when I finished my environmental science, I would have by default become an environmental scientist. But I started teaching and I realized this is what I want to do for the rest of my life. I walk into a class and I feel that energy from the students. I feel the energy within myself. And if I can teach every day of my life, I would not need a vacation. There are several countries which don't have extended education structure. I hope that my PhD is just a, a conversation starter for what's possible for the students during after school care hours, not just academically, but socially and emotionally. I have commenced my continuing academic role as lecturer in anatomy and physiology in the School of Medical Science, and I couldn't be happier. While I was undertaking my PhD, I found that the more I read, the more information I wanted to share with my patients. What I didn't realise is they would be more welcoming of that information, ended up having better outcomes because they became more invested in their rehabilitation process. I have a background in journalism and they often say uh, there are always two sides to a story. Well, as a PhD candidate you actually learn that there are many more sides to a story. It makes you look at things from very, very different and new perspectives. What I learned is how to manage a large-scale project and how to be persistent, how to make sure that you actually finish the project. Now that I have finished the PhD, I really feel like, yeah, I, I can do anything really. I honestly thought I would miss the hands-on approach to treating patients that made me feel good because I made them feel better. I've actually gained the exact same feelings of satisfaction with being able to teach students and help them learn and find a process of learning that works for them. I like to do a lot of different things and I can definitely see my future in this, this way. A lot of small things together make uh, one big career. I believe the PhD would take me to, a, to that satisfaction that my studies have contributed to the existing structure of after-school care in Australia and perhaps worldwide.